Typical Friday on the job quickly turned into one uh, a day that one Mount Juliet man will never forget. He was part of a chain reaction crash on Interstate 65. And if you haven't seen this video of it yet, it's pretty amazing. Our Chris Cannon talked exclusively with the driver about what happened. Chris. And Rory, David Grimes is a sales rep who spends a lot of time on the road. Friday, he heard a tractor trailer trying to stop from hitting him. Well, that driver didn't stop. And Grimes only has one word to describe what happened next. When you first see the images of this wreck from last Friday, it's easy to assume it couldn't have ended well. David Grimes wouldn't disagree. I just prayed and, you know, I just, you know, was, was, had a peace from God. And He was behind the wheel of this Honda CRV when a tractor trailer hit him from behind last week on Interstate 65. I can feel the car starting to crush around me and lifting off the ground. In a matter of seconds, Grimes was upside down hanging from his seatbelt as the two trucks dragged him along the interstate. It all ended as quickly as it started. When it all settled down, I mean, I was, you know, kind of shaking, you know, because I was like, what just happened? Good Samaritans helped Grimes out of his SUV, and he quickly realized he wasn't hurt, not even a cut. Really just um, from the airbag from the side curtain, um, you know, I think maybe like a, you know, the burn from the airbag was all that I really had. He quickly called his wife Melissa to tell her what happened. The first thing he said, he was like, I was in a wreck, but I'm okay. But Grimes didn't tell his wife everything. I had no details, no. So I just thought minor accident. I had no idea it was like this. Curiosity got the best of her, so she went online, and that's where she saw the same images everyone else was seeing. I thought there was no way anybody could have walked away from that. But he did, and he's okay. It was, you know, broke my heart that she had to, to see that and not, not be able to see me and know that I was okay, you know. As Grimes looks at the video, there's only one word he has to describe the experience. What other than, you know, a miracle. After seeing these images, it's hard to disagree with him. And Grimes and his family went to look at that SUV on Saturday, and in the back of the vehicle sat the Mother's Day gift he had bought for his wife. It was there, not at all damaged, but Melissa Grimes says she does not need it. She already got the best gift from her husband. That's him making out of that wreck unharmed. Rory. Truly remarkable. That violent wreck didn't keep Grimes from working either. He was back out on the road today. He actually went down to Murfreesboro to make the sales call that he missed Friday afternoon.